We're here to celebrate Hollywood's history through postcards and advertising. Yeah. And Hollywood is a very unique city in that it was a planned city by one man, Joseph Young, who came to South Florida and bought up a lot of land and decided to call it Hollywood, Florida. And he believed heavily in advertising for this new city. People can look and see what was going on here in the 20s. We have Joseph Young's Hollywood Reporters, which was his own magazine that he printed and published and spread all over the country. We've got a lot of ads, we've got a lot of sales brochures, we've got a lot of postcards, and there's a story behind the postcard. It's almost prehistoric texting. You would write a little message, put it in the mail, and off it would go. That rich history contributes to our charm and uniqueness today. It's because of the old buildings that are still standing that attract people to Hollywood. It's very important that we try to save the buildings that we have left. We're worried about the Hollywood Beach Hotel. You can see how gorgeous that hotel was when it was built. It doesn't look like that now, but it could once again. The fate is uncertain, so it's awareness about the importance of our historic preservation as well as reminding people and, and educating them about our history and how unique we are. History is one of the biggest things that we have in Hollywood. We should brag about it, and we are now. I ride by in the Hollywood Boulevard and I see all these fantastic houses. It's my dream house and one day I may live in one of them. It's talking about somebody that wants to buy a vacation home here for $32,000, ha ha. This is a gift to all of Hollywood and I really wished everybody would come out and just take a look at how phenomenal this is. Come, you will not be disappointed. I thank Clive Taylor for all his hard work and all the beautiful postcards that we have here. The display is in the Arts Park building and it's going to be here for two months. I encourage you to just come in, take a time, sit down, go through the whole exhibit, something that everybody should do.